That's Lightning! Oh, it's so scary! Oh, oh, are we starting? We're playing the Trash Horror Collection. Dude, ah, nothing's more scary oh than drugs, am I right? Yeah, drugs are terrifying. So scary. That's why I try to take them away from everybody. Yeah. And do them so that they don't look have how, to. Look how Wait. scary they are using those drugs. Oh my god. Uh, who's, ah. the, who's the trash whore? Uh, you are. You? Could I be? You? Both of you? Oh, hell yeah. Is We're the Trash Whore Sisters. <laughs> Trash Horse. Trash Horse. That's the Trash Horse Sisters. This is just a game that I found on Steam that like you, it's got like 10 games in it. Poop, Poop Killer. Killer. Poop Killer 2. Poop Killer 2. Two. Let's Poop Killer 3. <laughs> Wait, was that Jacob? The, clown, the Clown's, clown's fun. fun. Clown's Fun. The Clown's, clown's Fun. fun. <laughs> oh yeah. my God, that That's does. Jacob Fullerton. All right, we're going to play Clown whatever. So this is the game. This is terrifying. When I put that in place, cigar. Cigar picture. 1000. Not even C cigarettes, they're just cigars. What is That's a cigarette but a small cigar? So this is supposed to be, oh god. Oh my oh. god. That's trash whore. Why are we in one of the fake North Korea grocery stores? Coffee. <gasps> There's nothing scarier uh -oh. than a car slowly creeping by. What? Uh oh. <laughs> yeah, and the wheels are moving <laughs> yeah. sideways. Collect oh. the shopping carts from the parking lot. How do I? There's got to be a key somewhere then. And that it's know. a mystery. Oh, God. Oh, oh God. God. Hey, he didn't pay for that. Oh, he opened the door. Hey, he didn't pay for that. Did Who's he that get guy? some beer? Mm -hmm. Oh, I can, you can't go out that way. Okay. You gonna make a purchase, buddy? Sure. <clears throat> I'll help you out. Good night, Good night bro. bro. This beer is alcohol free, right? I'm driving and I don't want to cause an accident. That is the strangest Baltimore accident I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> I am going to work at Under Armour Factory. <laughs> Bro, do you have any old bay? <laughs> have you seen the wire? Okay, have a good job. Five dollar! <laughs> <laughs> Cha-ching! I like how we have an old-fashioned landline telephone, too. Yeah, I can't use the company phone. Uh, the rotary. I had one of those in my house growing up. It was like a wall-mounted ah, rotary oh. phone. No, you mustn't go outside in the clowning owing. Hour. Clowning <laughs> owing. <laughs> <laughs> clowning owing. Um, yeah, so the power went out a lot. My childhood home was struck seven times by lightning before we moved in. And mm. so I think was your house a tall metal rod? No, but like power would go out a lot. But for some okay. reason, power still went to the rotary phone. <gasps> But you wouldn't actually. Oh yeah, no, that's how it works. Yeah, you yeah. wouldn't that get. But you here? wouldn't get the phone signal because like the actual service wasn't working. So the power would be out, and then in the basement you would hear the ringing of the phone. Oh, that's fun. The basement was dark, and I'm scared. Anyway, no one was ever on the other end. I didn't. I was fine. Was it always just? Well, yeah. What would have? What do you think? It was. It was just. Oh. Well, there was the one time I answered, uh -huh. and there was a voice at the other end. <gasps> what did it say? I don't know. It was kind of hard to make oh. out. I think it was oh. something about my car's warranty. Probably. Is, <laughs> it, is the titular clown us because they just tricked us into working yeah. a job? Is it a clown with big tits? Oh, right. no. <laughs> the scariest part about most clowns is that they can take off their makeup and blend in with the rest of society. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Ah, oh. Clown, clown. He's, ah. hol he's holding a knife, right? Yeah, yeah he's, he's for sure holding a knife. Go yeah, but how are him. they supposed to do their job without a knife? Oh, there's a oh. police car. Police. Uh -oh. Police. Police. We're yeah. saved. The policeman. You know that guy's getting stabbed. Are we going to watch him get stabbed? Yes, I actually want a front row to that. This game is wildly unrealistic because a, a policeman would never show up if you said someone's watching you. Notice how the other guy <laughs> disappeared and then the police officer yeah, showed, showed up. up. Oh, you think it might oh shit. We can go. Oh, oh, God. Oh. Who got murdered? Oh, the police! No! Uh oh! Well, this guy knows. Told you. Um, Teabag up Shoot there. a 21 gun salute into him. <laughs> <laughs> uh -oh. oh. That's where the clown lives. Oh. oh! Oh, now that's where we live. You've been clown now. Oh! oh. Hello. <laughs> Wait, that's not a knife. He was just waiting for you to go outside the van. Everybody, we did it. We that's progressed. Is this the next game or the same no, game? No, you're in the fun house. Oh, I'm in the fun house. Welcome to the oh, fun God. house. Do, 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 oh, no, this is, is this just the do, 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 next level? Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. You know the classic saying, you could either live or dead. You have to. You have 100 science? points. You have to make it to the end. Let's go to the first game. In front of you is your best friend, Alfred. He has a shotgun pointed at his head. All right, is this like Saw? Essentially, uh, no. Saw is like the clown horror. Do we kill him or we let him live? I, I, would I, th I say kill him. I say always kill. Kill that guy. Kill, kill that, that guy. guy. Kill that. <laughs> <laughs> Second stage of our game. What do we do? What are the? I don't know. Oh. Cut my arm off. Cut yeah. off your arm. No. What? Easy. Yeah. Look at. Oh, we're That's shaking. The, we're shaking. You gotta go faster oh. than that. I'm not doing anything. I know. I'm talking. This to is this a cutscene. Huh. 
Oh, okay, cut. Barb. Oh, they don't oh, they show that. Oh, they censored it themselves. Yeah. It's so fucking easy to cut off your own hand. It's the easiest thing in the world. Why? Why? There's just nothing to it. I, uh, what, what? Is it easier than both? cutting off any other part it's, of your body? Uh, you just have enough force. Oh, There's enough nothing, force. Yeah. Patrick has oh. thin wrists. It's probably the easiest yeah. part of your body to cut off like that. One of them, okay. certainly, yeah. yeah. Somebody told me the other day that it's, it's uh, super well-known knowledge that it takes the same force to bite through your finger as it does to bite through a, a baby carrot. carrot. Is that carrot. widely known? Um, I don't know if it's widely known. You told me that. Mm. I told you that. Yeah, this used to be something that you worry about and fixate on quite a bit. Are we talking about like a bird's finger? No, no a like human finger. I think I don't know. Like I don't know if I'm believe right? if I believe. Yeah, you. I think. <laughs> I think we're talking about a bird's finger. Here. Somebody told me that it takes the same amount of force to bite through a carrot, a baby carrot, as it does to bite through your finger. Someone has told can, me and a lot of things. That can, aren't could true. you explain I, what a bird's? You have to say someone. What's a bird's All right, finger? That's enough of the clowns. A bird's fine, finger? You don't know about uh, a bird's fingers? No. What do they look like? Just. Google it after the show. <laughs> like a talon? <laughs> no, a bird's finger, like on a on the hand of a Wait, bird. Wait, you never tried a chicken finger before? It's summertime, baby. That means long days by the pool, going on vacations, and grilling with your friends. The Fahareti family lives for this time of year, and their brand captures that feeling of summer and adventure in their collection of high-quality clothing that's incredibly soft and comfortable, always sustainably minded, and meant to be worn from surf to city. Fahareti is a family-run brand making high-quality, timeless clothing with modern design and functionality. They've mastered the art of the perfect summer outfit. You know what I mean, effortless, but still looks good, super comfortable, but designed with intention. Kinda looks like it might be vintage, but it fits so well that it feels like it was just made yesterday. Just for you? That's what Faraday does best. I actually just got the Faraday linen. Lots of compliments, got a lot of pics off of the gram, so I can highly recommend getting their outfits. The clothes are thoughtfully crafted with a classic style. You will wear them over and over again. Faraday is so committed to sustainability, they even have a lifetime guarantee of quality. They'll replace or fix your clothes forever, no matter what. So your clothes can last as long as your favorite summertime memories. Right now, Faraday is giving all Funhouse viewers 20% off. Let me say that again, 20% off. Head to FaradayBrand.com slash Funhouse and use code Funhouse at checkout to get this deal. That's code Funhouse at Faraday, F-A-H-E-R-T-Y, Brand.com slash Funhouse for 20% off. FaradayBrand.com slash Funhouse. Joseph works as a fisherman on the high seas when he faces a storm and ends up sinking alone on a desert island. Oh, it's the most dangerous game. After exploring the island, he begins to notice that things are different from normal. Hey, what about this? What? Could you go into the water? Oh, oh look, I'm on land now. Be proper. Be proper. Ah. Oh, hello. And you are Robert. Welcome to Germany. <laughs> Welcome in our island. Would you like ein gross beer, bitte? <laughs> Can I tell you guys about uh, how I got beef with John Smith now? Okay. I got beef with John Smith because I don't, I've talked about it before. Different I'm, styles of clowning. Yeah. Terrified <laughs> of cockroaches. He is or you are? I am. You are. Have been since a child. I had a Batman Begins style thing happen. Yeah, I don't want to hear about it yeah, again. It's really upsetting. <laughs> so I told this to, to, to everyone. <laughs> and John Smith went, ooh, interesting. And he went into my office and started hiding fake cockroaches yeah. around my office. So the other day I have a meeting and I close my door so that I can just have this meeting in peace. And I see one of these fake cockroaches, which I've grown accustomed to. So I bend down to pick it up and, it and then real. it twitches. <gasps> And that's when I realized it was just a real one, and now I can't tell the difference between live and fake cockroaches. They're very realistic, the fake ones. Are yeah. you sure it twitched, or was it just in your head? No, it twitched for sure. And I and I screamed, and I ran out and got Tori, our office manager, and <laughs> said, Tori, Tori, <laughs> I need you to get rid of the Maybe scary Maybe need bug. some help. A few years ago, uh, a coworker of ours, Josh Flanagan, <laughs> had a pet scorpion that he kept at the office. Oh, no. And... One day he was he, allowed to do that. He did this thing where he moved it to a different cage, I guess, oh but no. took a picture of the empty one and sent an email around the office saying, <gasps> uh, "Guys, I don't want to alarm you, but the, the scorpion got out." And he placed fake scorpions all around the office and put GoPros and filmed everyone. Hey, Josh. Yeah. Come here. Is this him? Oh my God! Okay. Yep, I found him. Josh. <laughs> I mean, that's content, so we have to put respect on his name. <laughs> it is true. <laughs> it it is content. On his yeah, name. is John Smith filming this, at least? He's not. Yeah, no. that's just evil. It's, that's John Tent. Yeah. John Tent. I did him. film. I He's filmed, a John uh, Tent creator. Yeah. I, I like to do the thing where I stick. Oh, fuck! <laughs> what Was happened? that a fucking scorpion? 
No, I think it was a human centipede. <laughs> what? <laughs> the game is learning. I don't like <laughs> it. Now we're playing Endless Days. We're a lighthouse uh, keeper. You mean working at Funhouse? Marco says thanks, Dylan, for taking the job. Thanks. It's really hard to find lighthouse keepers these days. I agree. Sebastian, good luck, Dylan. The last lighthouse keeper is gone. We searched all over the place, but we haven't found is any leads on him. Oh, Sebastian. Like, um, Shut up, Sebastian! <laughs> Is that the guy from OK Go? We don't want to scare a new lighthouse keeper on the first day. Incidentally, the former lighthouse keeper was a little crazy. I like how all the humans in these games are all the exact same model of, with just different faces plastered onto them. Yeah. Well, you can only afford it's one. So Look one at this one guy's chonky donk. He does have a chonky donk. I like glide. the way he walks. Yeah. Chonky donk, chonky it's so donk. graceful. Have you thought about picking up horse riding, Patrick, enough that you do become bow-legged? I hadn't. Patrick, have you thought about picking up a just a fat ass? Um, Like the surgery. Yeah, getting those BBLs. Yeah, I'll probably get the surgery. Yeah, yeah, that's what I would say. I'm the opposite of bow-legged. When I bend my knees, my knees touch in the middle. Yeah, in-legged. Oh. In, in like <laughs> I'm actually a universal donor for BBL surgeries. <laughs> yeah. Because there is enough cake to go around. Nice. Yeah. So I'm just trying to do my part. Could I, like, request that? Yeah, I mean, but you get put you, on a list. There is a list, yeah, yeah, for people trying to get a slice yeah. of that cheese cake. Cheese. <laughs> I've Duh. been trying to get a nickname started at, at Cheek Savory. <laughs> <laughs> and no one seems interested. For like interested. a year now. Yeah, for, yeah. I was yeah. Say for a while. For a while. Can I like, for a while, I thought Elise was oh. going to bang. What? You thought Elise was going to You what? can call me Cheeks, yeah. Cheeks. Okay, I I'm going to start it. doing it. This game sucks. I want to play Poop Killer. Poop Killer! Oh, we're working in the blockbuster that sells... <laughs> or that runs out the tapes of the Put games. It in the trash. Oh. Toilet game. Go Boom take movie. a poop. <laughs> Are really we living up. in an abandoned office building? I think this is like our apartment. You live under the video. This is cool though. Kitchen. Like this. I like that. Yeah. You can I would get, build you that watch Sims. any movie you want. Any you can time watch you any want. movie you want. Yeah, for free. For free. My mom used to work at a blockbuster, and she Praise told me. Oh, oh, oh fuck! Uh -oh. Jesus Christ! It's just, a pest. It's, it's a layout guy. Le it's Heisenberg. Sebastian. No, it's a, a Sebastian Steven. like Leo or Lico or whatever his name is. Lino. Lino. I think it was Lino. So this is like a Hollywood video or a blockbuster because they don't have the curtained off section. Mm. Right? Yeah. No, the curtains right there. The, well, the adult no, section is just out there. It's yeah. in the front. Oh, yeah, right okay. there. I think the whole store. Oh God! Can you guys make out any titties? Marco, is oh, that you? He's right, probably sir, the poop feel killer. Free, thank you. Or he's, uh, or he's the first victim. He, no, Hello. I think he's the poop, he's <laughs> gotta be the poop, poop killer. killer. <laughs> yeah, go stand and watch him poop. Oh, I, we we are. I mean, we're gonna watch him die, right? I've <laughs> my god. I've got a fat dookie. <laughs> I've got a fat dookie, and it needs out. Are we gonna one? Two. I gotta see this animation. Drop them draws. Oh, what is he holding? Oh, he didn't even take his pants off. No, he's not wearing clothes. It oh. Was, Painted on. Oh. Why are you in there, Lindsay? Oh. Oh, that's oh. another poopy oh. nose. Goodbye. <laughs> you saved this man's life letting him use your toilet. You know when you poop and your hands are just out like this? You ever yes. have like, one of those dramatic poops? Oh. Fuck, this fat guy is going to ruin the bathroom. Okay, oh, well, well, he's the, oh, come that's, on. Yeah. Okay, let, not a great sign poops. for me. Yeah. I have heard that. I've heard poop? that. I've heard this fat guy is going to ruin the bathroom after people have let me use their bathroom. You guys ever have the kind of shits where you have to take off all your clothes? Oh, absolutely. Okay, <laughs> cool. What? Yeah. Yeah. You never I've had, had those? I've had shits where no, like it gets progressively worse and I take off and more. Oh, you're too yeah. hot. Yeah. Yeah. I see. Hot no, it has nothing to do. Like it has all, everything to do with the effort exerted. It's, Got it. Yeah, I saw a tweet huh. that was like, uh, my boyfriend... Took my off all boy, his boyfriend. My, boy, my boyfriend took off all his clothes in the bathroom, and then someone quote tweeted it and said, "My man's my man's fighting for his damn life." Oh, oh. oh. dude! Oh, here we go. One more thing. Come on. What kill are you gonna us, do? Kill us! Kill us! Kill us! Kill us! With poop. <laughs> Anyways, well, that's uh, the poop killer. I don't know. I mean, well, we never well, met the poop nothing killer. Nothing happened. I think but it, we know he exists. From what I've heard, things are. Oh! Really oh! <laughs> <laughs> it was worth it. Ew! He's got. It was not me. It was a customer. Is that us? That's us. That's us. Like, Why are we? Oh! Is he's that got a the frozen poop. Big salami. Oh shit. no 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 no! Motion. It has flies flying around it. Turn it up, Lindsay. Turn it up. Just oh, a little. So much. <laughs> No. Hey, open no. Up. no! Oh! Here's some soap <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>